Hello everyone, welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is black plastic in kitchenware. A study published in Chemosphere, October 2024, raised concerns about toxic flame retardants in black plastic kitchen utensils, takeout boxes and toys. The study originally suggested that exposure to BDE-209, a banned flame retardant chemical, was close to the safe limit set by the US EPA. However, a recent correction revealed a miscalculation, bringing estimated exposure levels to less than a tenth of the EPA's recommended limit. While exposure levels are lower than initially feared, concerns remain about long-term safety and recycling practices. Drishti IAS in Noida is offering an IAS GS Foundation prelims plus mains course in an offline batch. Admissions are open for the English and Hindi medium batch. For more details, contact 8750187501. Now let's discuss about key findings. Black plastic is often made from recycled electronic waste containing bromine, antimony, lead, cadmium, and mercury. Flame retardants in e-waste plastics are designed to prevent fire hazards but can leach into food when repurposed into kitchenware. Scientists argue that no universally accepted safe dose for BDE-209 exists as regulatory limits are outdated. Now moving on to health concerns, long-term exposure to flame retardants like BDE-209 has been linked to hormonal disruption, developmental issues and neurological effects. Legacy plastics containing banned chemicals continue to enter the recycling chain raising concerns about contaminated consumer products. Environmental experts advise not to discard black plastic utensils immediately, but to replace them when necessary with safer alternatives. People should consider stainless steel, wooden or BPA free plastic utensils as safer alternatives. Now is the time for practice question. What is a major source of black plastic used in kitchen utensils and takeout containers? Option A. Recycled ocean plastic. Option B. Recycled electronic waste. Option C. Virgin plastic production. Or option D. Plant-based bioplastics. Send the answer for this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.